Hi all, uh, in this video we'll be seeing how to add the typewriter effect in iMovie. So open the Keynote application and open a blank presentation and uh, uh, most probably uh, using a black background is better. So click on text to add text here and uh, double click on it and add the text that you want. Uh, I'm gonna add welcome to the world as the text and select the text and increase the font. And then I'm gonna change the style of the font as well. Yeah. Now double click the text again and select animate here, select built-in and add an effect. Here you can see all the animation effects and for the typewriter effect, uh, it's the same as the keyboard effect. Uh, some of you might have it as keyboard, some of, some of you might have it as the typewriter effect. So select the effect that you want and you'll see the preview here. If you want to increase the duration, simply drag right and drag left. I want to decrease it, so I'll drag it to the left. And then you can, you can watch the preview. And now uh, the most important step is to click on the background and go to format and select no fill here right once you're all done select file and export to as a movie and select the duration of the file and select the resolution as custom and probably change it to 1920 and click on next and then give the name of the file. I will give it as movie one and save it in a destination that's easier to access. And you can see the movie file here. So go back to iMovie and simply drag and drop this in your movie file. And since the starting bit is uh, empty, can simply drag this to where it starts and that's it if you try playing it you can see the typewriter effect here so hope you guys understood how to add the typewriter effect in iMovie you can add much more better effects uh, through keynote thank you